Hello my precious cinnamon rolls, my name is Fofo and I'm here back again after a bit of hiatus due to very couple busy weeks. I'm starting a new game in my Throwback Thursday slot and guess what, it's Tomb Raider Legend, which is over 10 years old now, which makes me feel ancient because I remember buying this for the PlayStation 2 when it first came out. And it's not a very long game, you can actually beat it in an hour if you do a speed run. I'm going to take my time with it though, and uh, we're going to play it on medium. Anayata telephoned me today. She had a room about an ancient. Oh! <laughs> oh, this is a flashback. For uh, PlayStation 2 models. Just because no one's ever caught one doesn't mean they're not real. That is very true, but perhaps they don't wish to be found. I've heard they're rather fierce. Yeti only look fierce. They probably don't like being so cold all the time. I shouldn't like it either. You never have to be cold, my Lara, if you don't want to be. Look! Uh -oh. Henry, what's happened? Need to crop. Hey, 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 hey. The Are we going to crash? Target engine non responsive. Not unless it's absolutely necessary. Stabilizer jam. Kicking runner and losing altitude. We're going full nose down. Close your eyes, darling. I don't want to close my eyes. This is now, I think. Yeah. Mm. You know, I think you forgot your climbing gear on purpose. What would give you that idea? Really, Zip? It's like going up a set of stairs, only far less boring. Yeah? Well, I want to throw up every time you look down. Hey, Alice is back. Grab a headset. Back so soon? <coughs> From Florence, wasn't it? Decided on Genoa at the last minute. My dissertation will never see daylight at this rate, but never mind that. What are you doing in Bolivia? Ascending. Alistair, meet two and arc. She's a lovely pre-Incan civilization, currently in ruins. Delighted. I've been looking for certain Okay. Well, I'll wait till she shuts up. <laughs> an old friend working in the powers has tipped me off about a rather promising rumor. What sort of artifacts? An ornate stone dais, among other things. A big rock, and she won't say why. Oh well. Where would the suspense be otherwise? I've never played this on PC before, so... Uh, <laughs> I'm not sure what the controls are like. Okay, first thing to talk about, this was the first game that rebooted Lara after the Angel of Darkness. Uh, Angel of Darkness, which was a big flop. You know, I kind of liked it, but it was a mess. I'm not denying that. Um, so, Crystal Dynamics, this is the first game by Crystal Dynamics. They rebooted Lara, they gave her a new continuity. Uh, there's a lot of things that link it to the old core design games though, like um, that plane crash cutscene we just saw was a part of Lara's original content core design continuity, but it was when she was like 16 or 18 or something, rather than she was a child, and her parents, in the original core design continuity, uh, Lara was disowned for being rebellious, rather than her parents being dead or miss and or missing. So... Um, in this continuity, I think she's even more posh than she was in the original, and she's a duchess or something. She's voiced, voiced in these games by Keely Hawes, who's a very pl very plummy British accent actress. And I'm playing with the controller, so I had to guess which buttons are which. So, playing this on the Steam version, which I think has some graphical improvements of the original. 
I looked for a high res texture mods, but I could only find a couple and it wasn't worth the hassle of installing them, so. Zip and Alistair, who we just saw in, oh, or heard in the intro. Uh, now, Zip is a character that was already in the series. He appears in Tomb Raider Chronicles. Alistair, I believe, is voiced by Greg Ellis. Um, this was his first appearance. Uh, triangle, I think. Well, it's not triangle, it's Y, but <laughs> yeah. Okay, kicky kick. These are these things that are relics that uh, unlock things like outfits and points and stuff. They're not terribly important. I'm just familiarizing myself with the controls right now. Remember, I have trouble with swimming in this game. <laughs> I don't think there's anything else in here. Check your PDA. It still works, if that's what you're wondering. Cool. They said it was waterproof. You should be able to swim with it, no problem. Unless you eat it, then you'll All have right, to wait. Push that rock. Uh, I like that checkpoint noise. <laughs> First game of checkpoints, too. There's a lot of hand holding, uh, hand holding in in Tomb Raider Legend, and I I don't mind so much. It's a very different feel to the game series than the original. Ooh. I've got a light somewhere. Look away from no, not screen. that one. That's my light. Right. Oh, I think if we go, actually, we don't need to be in here. I think there is a relic we can get if we. Don't do that. Maybe not. Maybe I'm misremembering. I don't know. It's been a long time since I played this. Yeah, this is the thing. This is the bit where the hand holding gets annoying because they just show you a slow pan through of the area and show, like basically show you where you have to go. Like, it's pretty obvious because the the grabbable edges Careful. are very obvious. <laughs> Whoops! This will be a long trip otherwise. It's very obvious, except when you miss them. <laughs> I don't. Uh, I don't quite know how I managed to do that. Oh well. First death. Eight minutes into my video. <laughs> Great. Oh, I'm all the way back over here. God. Let's just see. Uh... The video is going to make me sick if you keep on swinging, Lara. Look away from the screen. Then. Yeah, I think there's something. There's a relic there. I don't know how to get to it. I think we need to swing to somewhere else. Oh, oh, I see. There, there's another, there's another um, cave that. It's a nice way of getting moving around faster. Thing is that I believe this um, version of lava doesn't have a um, a roll where you switch directions like Cardo, Cardo, um the core games you could always do a backwards kind of you could turn around quickly by doing a roll. Oh, there's no option to oop <laughs> No option to skip that uh the cinematic kinda. Careful. Deep breath. I don't know why I, I went flying noise. off there last time. I forgot you were such an optimist. Oh, city. I think there's a yeah, there's a falling falling boulder here, which is not actually a threat at all. You just go. Oh no, there's a falling boulder. Oh no. <laughs> that was actually leisurely compared to the ones in uh, the car games. Too close. 
I might sound like I'm being unfair to this game. I actually like it a lot. I just like I like all the Tomb Raider games, but for different reasons. And this level's fairly straightforward anyway, but it is only the first level. I'm here, but I don't see no clue. Notice that big boulder. Yeah, well, I can't shoot on sight if I can't see nobody. I got worked up thinking I'd put someone down today. Now there's nothing. He owes me one. Got Lara's perfect, perfect yeah, fingernails. Any idea who he is or who he works for? I haven't the foggiest. He's deliberately on the mark. Oh, I still got my light on. Is that good or bad? It's deliberate, which isn't. Birdies! Good. Birdies! <laughs> okay, so we need to get up there. We gotta do a basic physical physics puzzle. The water's flickering a bit. Possibly this game doesn't work well on Windows 10. I don't know. Yep. Oh, come on. Mm hmm. This wrong. There we go. Just have to push that down there. Somebody said that the pushable objects in these games are like shopping trolleys, and they absolutely are. Can't remember who said that, but it was a. It was when um, anniversary had just come out, so it was quite a long time ago. <sighs> It's a shiny there. This um, what well, is our kind of zoom goggles? That's It'll show us different things we can interact with. They're kind of pointless because it's quite obvious that this is a shiny. And oh wait, yeah. got to figure out. Still got to figure out the controls. But that was. This is also Tomb Raider Grappling Hook Edition. <laughs> the, tomb, the grappling hook is used for pretty much everything. Set combat. So what? He jumped out and started swinging? Yeah, sort of danced around, screaming and yelling, whatever. Yeah? Well, I would have kicked the hell out of him. Yeah, whatever, man. Came flying out and screaming monkey talk like that. I remember how you. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> ah, it's come back to me. <laughs> Do cool flips and <laughs> stuff. The question is, why go to this much trouble to cause some ruins? Quite. Another thing about this game is you can only carry two guns at once. Uh we oh and um, we got you can only carry three health kits as well. Oh. And we're gonna go up here. Up. You can tell I played this a lot when I was younger. <laughs> I actually beat this game um, a day in a day and a half when it first came out. It's not very long. I think it's about 10 levels and each level is set in a different area but I think... Um, some of them are very short. But I think the final level is very short. Whee! Oh, how do I get down again? <laughs> That's a good question, self. Oh, okay. So that Lara can get um, her clothes that gets wet, in the, and uh, if you get her, if you if she falls in mud and stuff, her, her face will get dirty, which seems normal now, but at the time for that to do, for, you know, for Lara to get her face mussed up was a quite big deal. There we go. Right, where am I going? Got that. Where am I supposed to go? <laughs> I can't remember where I'm supposed to go. <laughs> That's where I went to get the relics, so maybe I just need to go over here. Oh yeah, there's um... There's a pole sticking out in the wall. 
It's PlayStation 2 era graphics uh, making it hard for me to see things. Gosh. Oh! Didn't see him that. <laughs> Alright, there's a shiny up there. Tomb Raider grappling hook. <laughs> Oh, we've got a. We can start a rock slide here if I remember. Isn't she beautiful? I'm falling in love all over again. You say that to all the ruins. I'm a terribly lucky girl. And here come the bloody tourists to spoil you. Oh, so Lara doesn't think of herself as a tourist. Okay. What do you see? Men with guns. Mercenaries, by the look of them. What are they doing there? So the trouble. soundtrack for this game is one of the best bits of it. Oh, uh, how do I do this? There we go. <laughs> hey, it's A little light murder. That's what. La that's how Lara Croft rolls. Oh, Hunter. relic. There she is. Uh, excuse you. <laughs> Yay, that's it. <laughs> trying to remember how to pull that off. Like cool slow mo thing that you know. Mm. Oh, I, I, uh, okay, right. Can't pick things up with guns out. I forgot about that. Also, Lara's pistols range kind of sucks. Oh, put your guns away, love. <laughs> how do I? Oh, there we are. I don't remember how to. Lara! <laughs> there you go. We trouble holstering, holstering them. Holstering them is not a word. Holstering. -ing 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 -ing. <laughs> Oh, hello. Uh, see, the range on them is, is awful. <laughs> and that's why they're your default weapon. Here's a health kit. Oh, he's got a gun. Now we've got something that actually shoots. Where is he? Eh, oh well. Can we not get on that? Uh, so clearly, looks like we should be able to, but we can't. Yeah, not grabbable. Oh, we can shoot that. I'm out of uh, ammo. I have to go back to my. Make her turn. <laughs> She's history. Okay. Health kits. Health kits. Health kits. I think we got everybody out here. We got a car. We can't do anything with. <laughs> just a model. There are um, vehicle sections in this though, there's a couple of motorbike sections in the game and they start out awesome and then get very very annoying. Uh, I think there's a relic around here somewhere. I guess not. No. And I think when I go through the into the ruin we'll get our first QTE is also a thing that's in this game because of course it is that sounded permanent death by irony is always painful amateurs yeah we're gonna that was a warning basically oh more gun Oh, because we can only carry two. We've got this one. Oh, we, I forgot we had over the shoulder sights. No wonder I couldn't hit anything. I'll keep this one. I like that one better. 
Oh no, this isn't a QT section yet. Shit! Press the wrong button! <laughs> I keep thinking circle um, B even is my um, uh, action. What is it? A grappling hook! Because that's what it was on the PlayStation. And it's not! It's this one! <laughs> Uh oh. Which idly, idly swinging. Uh. It's a useful survival skill. <laughs> okay. Oh, right, I've already got 20 minutes, but uh, I'll play a bit longer. Since it's the first episode. I need to get to a checkpoint, really. Oh. I'm actually taking a very What's long time to play this. <laughs> Moving heavy materials deeper into the mountain, probably. Sometimes ancient builders have to tunnel around hard rock deposits. Oops. Uh, and I think... Oh. Where am I going from here? Oh. I think there is a swan dive in this game, but I can't remember how to do it. <laughs> oh! Can do a forward roll. Can we do it? No, never mind. <laughs> there we go. Lara's oxygen bar in this game is horrendously short. <laughs> I think you can improve it with something. I don't. Maybe not. You can do that in the anniversary. There's a. Like a breath meter that you can unlock or get infinite air or something. I don't remember. I think there's a relic around here, but I don't want to drown also. There he is. There's a relic. Okay. Sploosh. <laughs> Possibly inappropriate noise. <laughs> Where I came in. Mm. No, it isn't. This is where I'm supposed to be. It's worth knowing most of the enemies in this game are actually people. Mm. We shouldn't have wasted uh, ammunition. On Why predators attack prey larger than themselves is a mystery. And a pity. Sometimes she absolutely oh shit! Me. Oh, that was stupid of me. I went right into that. <laughs> I have to kill the jaguar again? Yeah, thought so. No, yeah. oh crap! <laughs> I wonder if I can smush the jaguar. I've never tried that. <laughs> Come on, jaguar! <laughs> I guess that's a no. Okay. Wrong button. <laughs> is, is that a skull of a monkey or a person? Spooky. He's talking about the thing inside the crate. Uh, I can't tell either. <laughs> Here we take the shopping trolley. Oh, jeez. <laughs> right between halfway between those two so that we can get through both without smushing. <clears throat> you can actually do it with just just smush without just blocking the first one. Uh, I'm feeling lazy. <laughs> Patience and persistence. Okay, 
I'm going to end this episode here. This is our first proper puzzle. I'll do that next time.